Today, I will demonstrate how to set a prompt table in a different way than usual. This setup will be handy when prompt table takes forever to open. Let me, sh let me demonstrate that first. When you click on the prompt, you don't see the values auto-populated. Just type something here, select 100 and enter. Now the values are popped. The primary advantage with this kind of prompt setup is it's very fast and uh, performance wise it is way better than the normal one generally we do this kind of setup when you have tons of data and it takes a lot of time to load the prompt table let's see how to set that up it's pretty simple let's go back to the normal prompt table now if you see this is a normal prompt table so in order to convert it to, to the the prompt table setup I'm talking about is very easy. Just go to this navigation, people tools, utilities, administration, and look up exclusion table. Figure out the prompt table name. I already have done it for you. Click add button here. And add the prompt table name. And that's it. You're done. So now you can cancel it. Open the prompt table. Now you see the values are not auto populated. Throw some input, click enter. Now the values are populated. That's it. 